Can the rapid aging shown in the new M. Night Shyamalan movie, Old, actually happen to you? Welcome to Science Blast, a new series on science to save the world where we quickly explain where pop culture meets science. In the movie Old, vacation goers suddenly find themselves aging incredibly fast, confronting not only their own mortality, but each other. While critics are split, it has people asking themselves, can this happen to me? The good news is that while there are conditions which mimic rapid aging, like the disease progeria caused by mutation in the cell structure protein lamin A, or radiation damage, there doesn't currently exist anything that can do to you what happens in the movie, where the entire life cycle of growing up, maturing, and then decaying happens at a vastly accelerated rate. In fact, there's been research showing that perhaps we can go a bit in the other direction, reversing some of the negative effects of aging. For example, a recent study where participants received a combination of human growth hormone and two anti-diabetes drugs, DHEA and metformin, showed their biological ages were reduced by an average of 2.5 years, at least as measured by a proxy metric for age called an epigenetic clock, a so-called biomarker that measures modifications of DNA through time. More broadly, the human aging process is becoming increasingly understood through frameworks like the hallmarks of aging, and scientists are coming close to affecting it for real, as opposed to the thousands of years of false promises and snake oil before now. If you like this idea of stopping the diseases of aging or are enjoying our content, please hit the like button and subscribe. It really helps make sure that you'll get videos like this in the future. And if you're not sure on the science or the repercussions of life extension, please let us know why in the comments below. Now, while we won't get into spoilers, it's fair to say that by the end of it, Old has something to say about the slow pace of medical research. This can be helped by biomarkers, like the epigenetic clock mentioned earlier. Even things as simple as face and voice data can be used to create biomarkers which can predict your rate of aging or detect deadly diseases, including a virus which cannot be named. And armed with tools like this, researchers can understand the lifespan and health span effects of potential therapies much faster than waiting until everyone expires to find out. If you're interested in learning more, please check out this video we did about the Dog Aging Project, aiming to help our best friends live healthier and longer, or this video on our parent channel, Lifespan.io, about how diluting the plasma in your blood might be a powerful way to make sure that what happens in the movie Old does not happen to you, or at least happens far more slowly. Hey everyone, thanks for watching this video. This is a new kind of format for us on Science to Save the World, so if you like it, please hit the like button and let us know in the comments if you have any ideas for you know the topics you'd like us to cover in this format. Thanks, and see you next time on Science to Save the World.